What is up, my friends? Friday. You gotta love Fridays. Let's see if we can get this in there. Uh, yeah, the moon is out still. It is bright and early. It's in the mid 40s, and it's gonna be a good weekend. And I think it's gonna be 70s and sunny this weekend. We're gonna get some shit done. Might go shooting. I might do all kinds of shit because I got the hankering to get outside. Right now, I gotta work about half a day in the shop, and I gotta get some shit done at work. And uh, really, after that, I'm free to don't fuck around. <laughs> oh, hey, how about POTUS? Donald Trump called a news conference, had had the the media lined up out there they sent their brightest and best and the, the biggest ass hats they got and one by one he, he's smack 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 <laughs> sit down i understand your i understand i understand your question just sit down and i'll answer it all right the man is the boss as Milo says, he's daddy. <laughs> and he showed it. I'm so proud of our president. He, I know. He's, he's, he's just a normal guy. A rich billionaire. But it's, he's said, and other people have said, that I trust in. That he relates to normal people more than... He does the wreath the wealthy and that's obvious because the wealthy fucking hate him well they did until he started lowering their taxes and helping their businesses and getting their input the people who actually need to be giving input in America the people we need you know the people who cause commerce we need to hear from them the people who do education we need to hear from them the people who do and say and act, those are the ones that you need to, to listen to. Not the people who just talk about it all the time. They're the ones who need to listen. Not us listening to them. Uh, someone said that POTUS was uh, racist because he made a joke to a, a black reporter who asked about the Congressional Black Caucus, why is there such a thing? I have no idea. We're all Americans. It should be just the American Caucus. But uh, they, they were, he was supposed to meet with somebody and, uh, you know, the, the dude with the pacifier's mouth, but he was supposed to meet with that dude and someone from the media called him and told him not to or something. So Trump basically made the point that you, as the media, are hindering us from having a conversation so would you like to set up a meeting and they obviously want to take it as oh uh, you know them you're black which you know I do know a couple of guys that are black that know everybody that I ever meet that's black <laughs> you know and they know his brother too but you know when they're cool people and everybody know them everybody knows them because they're cool people not because they're fucking black Oh, so people ain't got no sense these days. Oh, man, I sure hope that you are going to have a good weekend. I hope you have a good Friday. I want you to think positive. I want you to smile and love people. Be happy. Find somebody who's different than you and look at their differences and, and try and see the differences in a good way, in a positive. And see how we all add to each other, being around each other. And we're all, it's a symbi symbiotic relationship. Everybody here. Now, some people serve different purposes. Some people drain the system. Some people add to the system. Some people contribute. Some people don't. But we all have a part to play. And someone told me today that uh, they don't. No one. No one deserves their respect. They have to earn it. Now, for me, that's just not going to fly. I have always been the kind of person that thinks that everybody deserves your trust to a certain extent until they lose it. But I do know that everybody deserves your respect. And don't go looking for a definition that fits your narrative. 
because everybody deserves your respect and respect in the way is you don't just give people angry looks or be a dick for no fucking reason you're just good to all people until they give you a reason not to be that's respect and everybody deserves it everybody deserves your respect otherwise you're just a dick all right today I hope you have a wonderful day <sighs> because it's springtime and it's, it's, it's got me excited it's got me excited because I know I'm gonna have a great summer we are going to have a build my son I'm gonna build him a shopping cart go-kart that I've, I've had it planned for a while but uh, it's it's finally gonna come to fruition because we have materials now You have a wonderful day. I love you. I'm praying for you. I hope you're praying for me because I need it. Y'all have a good one. Little doggy.